going through the water and it's going to start steaming off. And after a while, it should, there it goes. There we go. It should start jumping. And then what will happen is it will start carbonizing as the water heats up. And it makes these really cool patterns. Yeah, look at that. You can see it snaking out. Hey, Dwayne, check this out. Now I'm going to turn it off for a second. Yeah. And I'll take this wire and I'm going to move it out a little bit more here. Let's see if it can see get back up to speed. Yeah, there we go. That wire's not even really touching the wood, is it? Yeah, see, I don't need this now. Yeah, it's hot enough now that it is. Yeah, now it's, it's, it, it makes resistance. And what's going to happen is as this stuff dries off, don't breathe the fumes because I didn't use regular water, I used that. It'll uh, it'll keep making these trails, and um, I used to do it when I was a kid, like I said. And sometimes it would get ugly, and sometimes you get these really cool looking patterns. Hmm. It's like wood burning on that. What's the making it food? make the trail over in this direction anyway? Because uh, it's don't wet. Put your hand don't in put there. your hand near there. You're it's ten thousand volts. It's twelve thousand volts. Twelve thousand volts. Don't, don't, yeah, don't get your that would have been pretty good to get on video, though. No, because uh -huh. I would end no. up been giving him CPR. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I want you to do three. <laughs> you don't want Jerry CPR. He'll give you the tongue. Now, once the water evaporates, it, it'll get really strong because carbon connects pretty well. Now, they're starting to get ready to connect. Now, there you go. Now, you got it. Now you've got a circuit. See it? Uh -huh. That's a solid circuit with 16,000 volts going out, uh, 12,000 volts going through it. You know. Like I said, I used to.